Welcome to the channel. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how you can download existing mods for Blade and Sorcery Nomad for Oculus Quest Native. Before we get started, take a minute to click the S in the corner to subscribe. Heading for 10,000 subscribers, I'd love it if you were on the team. Also like, share, leave a comment, let me know what you think of the video or the game or any of the mods that you download and install. In order to accomplish this, you're going to need SideQuest and the ability to connect your headset through USB so you can access the file system. You're going to need either 7-Zip or WinRAR in the case of OS X. And you're going to need to make an account at Nexus Mods. And that's it. So let's head over to NexusMods.com. So once you've made an account, we're going to go to the Blade and Sorcery Nomad page by searching for it. Blade, we'll switch this to Games. Blade and Sorcery. And we can see here Blade and Sorcery Nomad. So we'll click on that and it's going to show us the mods that are currently available. Butter Stabs, Overpowered Gravity, One Bonk, Better Spells, Jonathan is All Powerful, which is the chicken in the game. So for this tutorial, we're going to download the Overpowered Gravity, along with other things I experimented with. So we'll click on this brings us to that mods page and then the download option is manual so we click on the manual download and we're brought to this page uh, which I click slow download I assume it's gonna ask you for some sort of payment if you click fast download and this is gonna download the 7-zip file of this mod so I've already downloaded it so I'm not gonna click on that but I'm gonna open a directory here that has the download which is overpowered uh, and we can see the extension is 7z so that's 7-zip now, as I said, for Windows, uh, I would recommend 7-Zip. It's a great uh, application. Go and download and install that if you don't have it already. If you're on OS X, then uh, WinRAR, oddly enough, WinRAR for uh, OS X, uh, will extract 7-Zip files. So once we uh, have our compression program, we can just extract that file. We'll just extract it here. And it is the all-powerful BAS jsondb so blade and sorcery json database i assume it's a zipped file and this is going to overwrite the bas json db that's currently on your quest so you're going to want to back that up so now we'll switch over to side quest and i've connected my quest 2 headset so i'm going to click on the folder icon in the header that says manage files on the headset and I'm going to navigate to the path Android OBB com dot warp frog dot blade and sorcery. So Android OBB com dot warp frog dot blade and sorcery. And this is where we're going to put that file. But first, we should download the backup file bas.json.db. So we'll click the save icon. And uh, we can't save it there because that's where we have our original one uh, so we're just gonna make a new folder here and we'll call it backup so select that folder and we'll save that file so now we have a backup of bas.json.db and so we can overwrite it with the modified version so to do that we're gonna click the plus and then the purple upload button this is the backup, so we're going to go up one directory. This bas.json.db is the one we've extracted from the overpowered 7-zip. And we just click open, and that's actually going to overwrite the bas.json.db on the headset. All tasks completed means that that mod has been installed. We can now put on our headset, open up the game, and enjoy the mod. All right, we've loaded up Blade and Sorcery Nomad after applying the mod we downloaded from Nexus Mods, which is uh, increased gravity abilities. So we'll see how those uh, shake out here. So here's our gravity ability. Oh, there they go. Whoa! Ayanara! 
I'm not quite sure how to throw these properly. Maybe it has to do with uh, imbuing the weapons with them. Hey, I grabbed one of her arrows. Okay, let's get that, uh... Gotcha! I don't even know where she went. Oh, up there. <laughs> it's a bit finicky, but if you do get a hit, they certainly go flying. the tree not sure what else this mod changed because it doesn't really have a detailed description guess you could look at the files really get to see the stretchy ragdoll physics with this. I think she went up through there. And she just disappeared. Come on, out in the open. You can basically have to touch them and then let go is what sends them flying. beat them down. Come on. Upsy daisy. What's that? Heard her off in the distance there. <laughs> That's fun. That was a nice uppercut. Up you go. Well, there you have it. How to install mods for Blade and Sorcery Nomad from Nexus Mods. If you haven't already, take a minute to click the S in the corner to subscribe. Heading for 10,000 subscribers. Be fantastic if you were one of them. Also, like, share, leave a comment. Let me know what you think of the video or the game. And let me know about any of the mods that you try or that you think I should try. All that good stuff is appreciated if you enjoy the content. Thanks for watching, and we'll catch you next time.